Softball teams hit the diamond for some state championship action today. The St. Charles Saints face the DGF Rebels for the Class 2A title. We had to keep our head in every game. Like Just that first game here coming to state, it was close and we had to stay into it. And Getting through all those games and getting here and knowing what we could do and what we, what we could accomplish definitely brought our mindsets in this game very high. The Saints are in the white jerseys. The Rebels are in the black. DGF went up early in the first and never looked back. In the seventh, the Saints are down 3-1. to one. Emma Chuchna gets a single to left field. And then Grace Baringa is up to bat. And she gets a hit to right field. Take a look at this one coming up next. And that one is overthrown at third base. Emma goes for it. And she is called out at home plate for the final out of the game. Rebels are taking home the Class 2A title, getting the 3-1 to one victory. Despite the loss, Coach says that's how the Saints want to play. And he is proud of what the team did this season. How much they mean to you. Um, you, you can't describe it. And, and they know that. They, they don't want to leave. And everyone, you know, I think everyone's sad because we lost, but I think there's a group of nine girls there that will never play softball again. And they need to know how much they meant not only to, to us, the coaches and in this team, but also the community. A big thing that came from us going to state these last few years is that we've made an impact for the younger girls who now want to be us and be like us. So not only did we make a name for ourselves, but we're going to make a name for the younger girls who are coming up. Congrats to the Saints on a fantastic season. And the boys' individual tennis state tournament wrapped up today. We have one athlete that hit the court in class single A. Lord Marhan Veldek took on Zahir Hassan from St. Paul Academy in the semifinal match this morning. And Eagles Marhan advanced to the championship, and he is bringing home that championship title. Marhan knocked off Evan Frazier from Mounds Park Academy. Congrats to him. And track and field athletes are competing in day two of the state tournament. We talked about class 2A in the earlier show. Here are a few results from class single A finals. In the girls 100 meter dash, first place went to Chantel Ryland from GMLOKS. First place in the 100 meter wheelchair dash was St. Charles' Tyler Gunnarsson. And in the girls 4x200 meter relay, Chatfield came in first. In the girls 200 meter dash, Dovriota's Taylor Kurtz got first.